I was bullied from a really young age. Um, I was a really skinny kid from the wrong side of the tracks who was kind of poor, who wore the same pair of pants every day in sixth grade. So on one level, I probably deserved a little bit of ribbing. Um, but, uh, you know, I, I was bullied to the point where I, I felt like I had to have my mom walk me to school. Like, I really felt like, you know, I was physically in danger. I think, you know, bullies get away with it because no one says no. And I just said no. And suddenly, it changed the entire dynamic. Anybody could have said no on my behalf. It took my own self, it just took that adrenaline inside of me to just bubble up to the point where I couldn't take it anymore. And um, I had to defend myself. Um, but man, I wish someone else had said no. You know, I wish someone else, I wish the other girls that pushed that girl into me, who was kind of the leader of those girls, had, you know, had, had, had known that how hurtful it was. And, um, and how scared I was. I think if someone had, had stood by and said to this girl, like, why are you bothering her? Like, what are you getting out of it? How's that making you feel strong and better? Um, because that's what it's about. Bullying is about people who, who also feel like they only get power by putting other people down. What a terrible way to go through life. I feel bad for bullies, <laughs> you know? And I think, by the way, saying that would have been great. I feel bad for you that this is how you get off. Say that to a bully and see what happens. See how that changes their, the dynamic in their life. It makes them look inward. Um, I think that, that could really be powerful.